Mob of the Dead was the turning point for the zombies game mode. Here's five things that did right. Mob is far less restrictive than the last two maps. There's no restrictions on your movement and buildables were streamlined by allowing players to pick up more than one part at a time. Mob continued to make improvements to the game's weapon sandbox. The Tommy Gun, Uzi, AK-47, and Blundergat are exclusive to this map, alongside special weapons like the iconic Hell's Retriever and Golden Spork. Mob's gameplay loop is unlike anything we've seen in Zombies. The afterlife mechanic not only removed Quick Revive as a crutch perk, but also flipped the entire concept of the power switch on its head. Mob of the Dead does not restrict player strategy. There are a number of viable camping and training options in both solo and co-op games, which helps keep the map fresh. Mob of the Dead has the best story, characters, and atmosphere in the entire franchise, campaign and multiplayer included. It works both as a standalone piece and as part of the greater storyline, and fans have been asking for more standalone experience like this ever since.